much for watching on here. Thank you for taking the time for checking out my channel and my content. Uh, this video has been requested by loads of people and so I thought I would do it and hopefully you'll enjoy it. So without further ado, here's a look at the H and Cygnus, my absolutely wonderful um, Hunter Spider. Okay everyone, so here's a look at the H in Cygnus. I know a lot of you have been asking me to do an update on this spider and I'm very happy to say that I have some good news for you. I'll just turn the enclosure around and have a zoom in down here. I don't know whether you can see that just down there, but that is a molt and the spider is just on the uh, underside of this log. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the molt out and have the spider and hopefully feed it. Okay then, so here is the H and Cygnus, the banded huntsman spider, um, absolutely wonderful, wonderful little arachnid. These are very very fast moving but they are harmless. You usually see these on Facebook and things like that where it's someone's got one in their kitchen or something like that and they're made to look bigger than what they actually are but don't get me wrong these do grow very large but they are harmless there's genuinely nothing to worry about if there was any risk of this causing serious harm to anyone I wouldn't be saying otherwise so so that's a look at the uh, the actual spider I'm gonna place that down there for a minute and while I do that I'm gonna go in and grab the malt so here it is you can see uh, very kind of spindly but it is all there and I do actually have a microscope so I'll be taking a look at the uh, see if I, can, if I can find the sex of this and I'll be posting that to my Instagram so if you don't have Instagram or you don't have me on Instagram you can follow me at Tarantula Dan links are in the description you can check that out and uh, you can find out what this is you can see how well behaved this spider is. It's uh, the entire time I was dealing with the molt, it was just sort of chilled here on the log. And what I'm actually going to do is very carefully just show you how aggressive and horrible these spiders are. Just going to very carefully coax it onto my hand. So you can see it's here not causing any trouble at all so I was just thinking about how well, well behaved this was and I decided to switch lenses and while taking the lens off to swap them around and things like that I had this spider on my hand, on my finger shall I say the whole time and it didn't budge so yeah as I say you see these a lot on social media um, in people's kitchens and houses and terrifying people and all that kind of stuff that the media like to sensationalize on but these are genuinely just absolutely wonderful spiders they are very fast but they are harmless to humans and they are amazing eaters as well and you may some of you may notice that this is the same spider same species of spider that is used in my YouTube logo and the reason for that is because my previous um, my previous specimen I had the uh, adult female that I had was actually one of my most requested and most kind of loved arachnids on my channel so I kind of made her my logo and uh, so yeah this is the spider that the logo comes from absolutely beautiful spiders some people don't like them because of the kind of long spindly legs and, and things but the wonderful things about Huntsman's is the, apart from how docile they are, is the amazing kind of colour variants that they come in and uh, they have some really awesome uh, and beautiful cuttons and patterns, cuttons, colours and patterns, they're very desirable and they're cheap as well. I bought this, I think it was at the BTS and uh, I think I paid, I think it's one pound fifty for a tiny sling. So yeah, absolutely wonderful, wonderful spider. Nope. Gonna have a bit of a room now. You 
can see I'm not freaking out or anything. If this spider posed any kind of a threat, then I wouldn't be doing this. You know, I don't want to encourage handling. But what I also don't want to encourage is people being scared of spiders, especially when there's no need for them to do so. I'm trying to show that actually these are harmless and genuinely do not cause you any harm or distress or anything. You know, the whole the saying that they are more scared of us than, uh, than we are of them. Absolutely wonderful, wonderful spiders, and one I would recommend anyone who keeps tarantulas or spiders to own if you don't already. So I'm going to put her back now. I don't want to sort of stress out too much. I'll just place the log here, and uh, coax her onto it. There you go. Notice how she stayed on the log. She'd be quite chilled there. Well, she didn't want to eat, so I have just put the food in her enclosure. She did molt her several days ago, so she should take it down at some point. So I'm going to place her back in now, and uh, leave her to enjoy the rest of her day, I guess. So for those of you that have been asking me to do a video on my Huntsman, and to see how it's doing, that was an update on her. And as I said, the molt that I have just here, I'll be taking a look with my microscope and I will be posting a picture of that on my Instagram so you can uh, you can all have a look and see what the, uh, the sex is which might be pretty cool So I hope you all enjoyed this quick, very quick video. As always, thank you for watching my content. I do appreciate it. Hope you all have a lovely day. Take care of yourselves. And I'll see you all soon in the next video.